Brian O'Bannon coming at you once again, ladies and gentlemen, with another edition of Morton Moment. And let's take this moment to talk about hybrids. Now, what am I talking about when I say hybrids? Well, as you can see here in the background, we have an example of some wooden walls right there with a steel trust roof and ceiling. And the reason why we do that is because when you start getting your buildings really wide, wood trusses will tend to get a little flimsy. And so what we do here at Morton, we design, engineer, and manufacture our own proprietary lightweight but very strong trusses to be able to put in buildings that are pretty wide. And we combine it to where it still fits on our wooden walls. And again, just because it's wood doesn't mean it's not strong. As a matter of fact, it's engineered to be just as, if not stronger, than the steel. The difference is, though, as you can see, is our wall still remains nice and flat, very low profile, and then as far as the insulation value, is amazing. After all, if I took a torch and I burned a piece of wood here at the end and I let you grab the other end, you'd probably grab it. If I did the same thing to metal, heated the one end with the torch and let you grab the other end, you probably wouldn't want to grab that because steel is not a very good insulator against cold and heat. And that's why we like our wooden walls, but yet we have to use some sort of steel truss and again, when you have steel trusses like ours that has all that opening, uh, the gaps up there, you know, the, the skeletal look, that keeps as much as possible key, uh, the, the cold and the heat from the actual roof from going through and absorbing down into the actual ceiling of the building. So that's why, again, when you have a very large building that you need to be able to hold the roof up, but yet you still want to be energy efficient, Morton is definitely, no doubt, your bet. And that's it for this week's of edition of Morton Moments. Be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.